Today's episode is brought to you by Subway. Oh, uh, hey, what can I get you guys? Hey, could I try the rotisserie style chicken? A uh, sweet onion chicken teriyaki for me. Oven roasted chicken, please. Chicken and bacon ranch melt? Yeah, you got it. <laughs> so that's why they're called the chicken girls. <laughs> Subway, home of the chicken girls. Hey, hey, Attaway, Jesse the Hawk Hawkins here. Don't forget to sign up for Fall Club. Whether you're looking to pad your resumes or get closer to your cute bio partner, don't miss out. And last but not least, driver's ed starts today, so if you're 16 or older, sign on up. Everyone else, bug them for rides. Deuces. Well, this article is just going to write itself. Just comes easy to you. That's why you're the editor. Yeah, but I still need to earn the title. And all of the upperclassmen are really not stoked about it. You already earned it. Besides, you must have like a million good ideas. Not exactly, but I do have a main idea and I think I want it to be about an advice column. But it's more of my sister's idea, so. What's it called? Well, we were thinking Hey Harmony, because her name's Harmony and she always has something to talk about. So we would get anonymous letters from people and we would answer their questions. Maybe I could be your first customer. That's sweet, but I'm gonna need a lot of customers for it to be a regular column. And so far, I have none. It's not going so well. You never know, maybe they'll just magically appear. All right, well, I have to get back to class, but I will send you a few quotes to review before we print the article. Can't wait to never have to ask for a ride again. I don't know, Rune. Look, I know after everything you've been through, this must be scary. Cool, yeah. I mean, it's just every time I like hear a car. Hey, didn't the doctor say you have to be in cars more? <sighs> Can't you just drive me around? Come on, Birdie. I'm gonna be with you every step of the way. I promise. Okay. Okay. How many delegates were at the Constitutional Convention? 55. What year was it? 1787. Right again. Who presided over the convention? Hey, would you guys say I'm more outgoing or more funny? Why? Oh, well, I'm doing a quiz for Trey Chic about what kind of boy band I should be in. Hey, sharper edges. Hey, don't even think about it. Not one bite? Chicken sub looks so good. This is mine, and I need all the energy I can get for this debate today. Also, the answer is George Washington. Quinn. Jared Danger has literally been to every nightclub in New York City. I like his haircut. I, I mean, I mean, it's it's really bad. Like, horrible. It's hate it. I'm sorry, I didn't see you there. My bad, sorry, that was like my fault, no. But... How do you like the book? I certainly don't understand why everyone's so obsessed with Daisy Buchanan. She's like, really annoying. What do you think? Keep reading. Honestly, I'm listening to it on tape. I, I know it sounds super nerdy and everything because like, I, I just think it's better when I hear it. 
Yeah. Yeah, yeah, no, that, I find, that's cool. Yeah. I don't think it's nerdy at all. So. Yeah. Cool. I'm going this way. So. I am too. Okay. I hope you're all prepared for the first major grade of this class, the Federalists versus Republicans debates. You should have all prepared your defenses last night, so let's get started. Driver's Ed. Finally something we can do together. Are you even old enough for Driver's Ed? Ty, you know I'm old for my class, right? You didn't forget my birthday, did you? Of course not. I actually have something really big planned for November 20... 20... 27? It better be huge, Ty. Huge! I believe in states' rights because we don't need some higher power getting involved in making decisions about our lives because we were doing just fine before and now all of a sudden we're expected to check in constantly to tell the government what we're doing, where we're doing it. We are a free state. We are a strong central government. If you take two single states and put them together, they are greater than the sum of their parts. How are they greater if the states forget who they are in the process? Hamilton and the other Federalists just wanted what was best for me. I mean, the country. Say one state really likes sandwiches and the other state happens to be really good at making them. When they come together, they are stronger and they can pool their resources and go out for macchiatos at juniors. I mean, sharing the burden of taxes. Okay, we shouldn't be held accountable for the whole country. We've paid our taxes, that's crazy. Don't be so self-righteous, Jefferson. You're a slaveholder. That's irrelevant. No, no, that, that's not irrelevant. It's very important. I, I'm not a, making excuses for him whatsoever. That, that topic is out of the conversation. For one, I am sick of being held accountable for the misdeeds of other men around me. Thank you all. I think that's a good place to stop. Really well done, Ellie. <laughs> I just... I don't understand why you had to go so hard on me. It wasn't about you, it was about Jefferson and Hamilton. <laughs> why do you keep bringing him up? I'm not bringing him up, Quinn. I gotta go. I, I had to miss school the day after my breakup because my face was so swollen. Couldn't even open my eyes. So, yeah, I, I get what you're going through. But look, Ellie's right. I think you need to try and let Hamilton go. How can I? He's everywhere I look. Just erase him from your phone. Look, delete all of your photos together. Get rid of social media. You need to do a Hamilton purge. <sighs> Get rid of it. Hey, we have the newspaper meeting. Not today, boss. What? Driver's ed. For those of us who are 16 and older, Texting? No one. God, why do you have to be so paranoid? Like, how many times do I have to tell you that I'm not talking to her anymore? I quit the appeal. I'm sorry. I... You're right. I really appreciate you cutting off contact. I'm gonna get a coffee. You want one? Thanks, babe.
Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to driver's ed. The most important class you will ever take because when you get in a vehicle, you don't use your head, you wind up dead. Got it? Is this guy for real? <laughs> I think he's dead serious. Do you think this is a joke? No, no. No, no, sir, I don't. Sorry. You okay? Yeah, uh, I'll, uh, I'll catch up with you. Okay. Nice of you to grace us with your presence. Sorry. Now, for all present and accounted for, we'll begin today's lesson. Any questions? Yes. Uh, when will we be driving actual cars? When you earn it, Missy. Operating a vehicle is a privilege, not a right. Now, if that's all, let's watch today's safety video. Get your hopes up and run I lie if I said it ain't fun I know your type Lighting up my phone late at night So good at taking With most of the upperclassmen at driver's ed, this is gonna be a short meeting. In fact, maybe we should just cancel. You're the editor, you tell us. Fine. I guess we can try to go on. Does anybody have any pitches? Arthur. I think the cafeteria food has been laced with GMOs and laxatives. Okay, what makes you say that? Well, there's an online form right here that basically proves it. And Mr. Dukakis has the burger every single day. It spends most of the fourth period in the bathroom. <laughs> Anyone else? All right, how about Hey Harmony suggestions? Do we have any? Uh, one. All right, well that's a start. What's it about? It's about GMOs and the cafeteria's food. Wonder who that could be from. Oh, me, that's from me. Okay, well how about you do your research and we'll get back to you. Meeting adjourned. Hey Queen, uh, can you tell Dad to come get me? Uh, no, it's it's not over. It's just um, I need to get out of here. Texting while driving creates a crash risk 23 times worse than driving while not distracted. Bad texts can wait. Don't drive distracted. They crashed into another car. She's hurt pretty bad. In their first year on the road, teens are almost 10 times more hey. likely to be in a crash. You okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Keep it quiet back there. It should be okay, right? We don't know, sweetie. No matter what happens, we need to stick together. How long have you been standing there? I just got home. Why are you on my bed? Too much stuff on mine. But Harmony said she'd help me clean up later. Thanks. It's getting kind of messy in here. No problem. What are you listening to? Just this book my friend recommended. Great Gatsby. Have you read it? time on Chicken Girls. She's all buddy-buddy with you and Quinn and Harmony. It's, it's weird. How's that knee? It's had plenty of time to recover, right? Everyone's counting. Come on, Ty. Oh. Are you willing to put your money where your mouth is? 